I'm getting very close to being done. Um, a little bit of a stopping point right now. I'm waiting on some things to show up. Uh, most of, mainly what I'm waiting on is the chrome vinyl decal, you know, pin striping that I need to run along the red stripe and then across the uh, the fin in the back. Um, I can't fully attach the hoses or the ladder until I do that. Right now I just have them, I have them in place, but they're not really fully attached. Um, I also need that chrome so I can finish that red light that goes on the top there. I still got to build the little white strobe. Uh, the light bars, I'm going to have to change the lighting in them. One, I don't know if you can hear them, they're really loud. They sound like a bunch of bees buzzing. Uh, but the other thing is, is on two of them now, the bulbs are burnt out. And these bulbs are, you can't just change them. They're part of the wiring. So they don't like sit in a little socket. So you can't just pull the light bulb out and change the light bulb. So now that if they're burnt out, I can't just change that bulb out. Uh, so I'm just gonna, I'm gonna see what else I can come up with for the lighting for those parts. The lighting in the front and the back, the, the wigwag portion, uh, those were just some halogen style work lights. I pulled the halogen bulb out and stuck a blue LED in them. So this way I don't have to use a heavy duty power source to run them. I just picked up a little flasher like from Walmart. Got the roof rack all up in place. Got the ladder in place. Like I said, it's not fully screwed in yet, but it's, uh, it's in place. I still need the chrome trim for you know, around here. It's gonna go across this and a couple verticals to make it look like more windows. Then the chrome is gonna go across the top of the fins and on this section right here. Still gonna put the little tail lights in. Obviously the logos. You see, I pretty much about got everything done. Got the hoses on the side. And what I'm doing on my roof rack you see that box that I had right there? I turned that into essentially my power supply box. That's what's gonna hold all the, the stuff for the little flashers and all that. So I said it's all gonna run off 110. I'm gonna have one cord where I just plug it into the wall and all the lights are gonna work off that. So this way they can run for hours and I don't have to worry about charging the battery or anything like that. So, but uh, I'm getting really close. Hopefully the Next video that I uh, post will be the completed car. I'll pull it out in the sun and everything so we can get a good look at it. Thanks for watching.